Hey there, Rush fans. This is Mark Benetti alongside you for your latest edition of Behind the Bench, presented by Assurance Solutions, where we ask two of your favorite Rush players questions you've submitted to us on our social media platforms. This week, I'm joined by a pair of newcomers to the Rush organization. To my left, forward Joey Sides, and to my right, forward Dylan Clark. Joey, I'll go ahead and start off with you. You're a native of Sun Valley, Idaho. Before your professional playing days, did you ever visit Rapid City before? Um, no, not before... I had played here. First time was with the Arizona Sun Dogs when I came to play here. How was that experience? Uh, it was wild in the rink. We we took a trip up to Mount Rushmore with the team, and uh, that was fun. So I got to see a little bit of the area, but um, yeah, definitely a, a fun place to play. Dylan, I'll turn to you. You went to SUNY Plattsburgh for college, which is the alma mater of Coach Ferris. You think that earned you any brownie points coming out to Rapid? The better of it. I didn't come here for no reason, so... <laughs> <laughs> That was a great, it's an unreal school. Uh, Joey's got all the records there, and um, he's he's kind of an idol around town. And, uh, you know, it's uh, it's good to be here to play under somebody that we can have the same background kind of thing, too. So it's good. What was it like seeing all of his uh, records plastered up on the walls over there? Uh, kind of intimidating. You know, it's uh, you always want to break one of those records, but uh, there was no chance, not even a little bit. So you, you didn't come close? I had less... Uh, points and he had goals, so uh, it, was, it was tough. Wow. Joey, I'll turn back to you. When I first heard that a guy named Joey Sides was coming to town, I could have sworn that was some villain taken out of a Dick Tracy uh, episode or whatnot. Do you have any Italian in you? Yes, I do. Uh, Sides is actually German uh, from my dad's side, and then uh, my mom's is Spolino, so that's where the Italian comes from, from okay. Sicily. Gotcha. Yeah. Interesting. What did, what did you think when you first heard a guy named Joey Sides was coming into the town? Did the same thought register with you? Uh, I was more of a food processor or something. I thought <laughs> one of those sidekicks. You know what I mean? <laughs> but uh, no. It's you, a sharp name. I don't know. It's pretty sick. <laughs> ah, it definitely is. And I'm sure if somebody else on the opposing team gets that same thought, it's uh, very intimidating for them. Yeah. That'll do it for your first half of Behind the Bench. We'll be right back after a quick word from our sponsor. My job at Assurant involves keeping our customers informed at a time when they need us the most. I care about doing a good job for my company, but mostly I care about the people I serve. I found the same spirit of caring in a lot of my coworkers at Assurant. In the communities where we operate, we get involved with outreach groups and local charities. The same teams that are so good at helping our customers are also hard at work helping out in our neighborhoods. I think if I had to tell somebody one thing about assurance, I'd say we care. And we're back with your second half of Behind the Bench presented by Assurance Solutions. This time, Dylan, I'll turn off to you again. Uh, last week in the season ticket holder party, I, I made the comment that if you keep playing at the rate that you will, people will start calling you Clark Kent around town. Has it started happening yet? Uh, no, thankfully. <laughs> uh, that's a little bit of a too high of a standard to live up to, so uh, I just stick with myself, my own name, and <laughs> hopefully that, that one catches on too. Do, do you have a cape hiding in your locker just in case that moment comes? Just the one I borrowed from uh, Sides over here, so <laughs> just uh, that's about it. You had a cape? Uh, no. <laughs> no. Just just when I go to bed, I put it on. <laughs> so, if, so if Clark Kent isn't your, your nickname, what is? Uh, Clarky, Bones, Rattles. Bones, <laughs> Rattles. Skinny guy, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> if people want to call me the Hulk, that'd be a little more appropriate, but I, I don't think that'll catch. <laughs> that, that, is, that is unreal. Wow. Uh, Joey, we turn to you. Clearly, you have the best flow on the team. Oh, wow. Um, if nobody's <laughs> noticed through four games of the season, do you think you have the best flow in the league, though? Uh, I haven't seen the rest of the league, and, uh, you know, not a title I was going after. just figured I'd let the soul flow throughout the summer, and, uh, you know, now it's coming out the helmet pretty big. But um, if some people say it's the best on the team, I'll take it. Best in the league, sure, <laughs> you know. Does it give you added strength? I think so. It gives me added protection for sure in, in the helmet. What, what about you? Best flow on the team, best flow in the league? Uh, I don't know. Woodley had a pretty good one the other day. <laughs> oh, the quad forward? Yeah, uh, but he looks like Krusty the Clown out there a little bit. <laughs> 
Awesome. Thank you so much for your time this week, guys. I greatly appreciate it. That was your latest edition of Behind the Bench presented by Assurance Solutions. And don't forget to submit your questions to us on all of our social media platforms.